Hey everyone, Andy here at uh, IBC 2015. I'm in the DJI booth checking out the brand new uh, X5 and X5 Muse gimbal system for the Inspire. I'm here with uh, Kevin Gordon from DJI. Uh, so Kevin, can you tell us a little bit about this new system? Absolutely, Andy. So this is really a revolutionary step in the whole drone space mm. because now for the first time we have a micro four-thirds system that is flyable in a single package, ready to fly, um, such as on the Inspire here that allows you to have interchangeable lenses and a whole wealth of other features, which we'll talk about, um, available for the first time on a, on a drone. That's great. So the X5 itself is a micro four third camera, as you said, uh, and, it, and just gimbal that's designed specifically for it, right? Correct. That's and now the X5 is video only, but there's another version coming as well? Right, so the, the X5, as you see it here, um, is a conventional four thirds setup, however, we have a higher end even um, system, which is a raw version, X5R. X5 so the X5R um, allows complete, you know, creative flexibility in post colorization, um, up to 14 stops of, of latitude. I mean, it's really an incredible, incredible step forward in drone technology. And, you know, I mean, in the past, you were able to take advantage of flying really high-end cameras, but it required a bigger platform that also has its own limitations. You know, now we have the Inspire, which is a suitcase, you know, out of the box, ready to fly in just minutes uh, system that you can use this new technology. And the great thing about our approach to this is that even if you're a current Inspire owner, you can buy the X5 upgrade and upgrade the system that you already have. So if you have it, you can replace the, the, the camera system that came with it with the X5. And Correct. Yeah. That's right, in either of those two flavors. Uh -huh. And you know, shipping this month, the X5, and in December, or the end of the year, the X5R. So on that note, the interchangeable lenses you brought up, uh, I see there's, there's a 15 millimeter micro four third lens on there from DJI right now, but Correct. there's other options as well? Absolutely. So. Uh, every lens has its own um, profile that needs to be programmed in uh, for the dynamics of the gimbal. Sure, yeah. So currently we have the 15 millimeter uh, lens and the 12 millimeter lens from Olympus, which we find many of the micro four thirds owners will probably have. It's a real go-to lens. So you can get the system lens free and use the lens that you already have. So more lenses in the future as they as they, as they become available? That's, that's right. I mean, it's it's a wide opportunity in the Micro Four Thirds system. That's right. So, uh, focus control, I saw this DJI Focus, which is right over here, yeah. looks like. So, I know this is a system that's designed to work with a motor as well, but you could also use it with this, is that right? Yeah, so uh, the exciting thing is it's uh, available in two versions. One that uh, has a motor comes with it that is for the Ronin and Ronin M, and another one that will uh, plug into the remote controller of the Inspire and allow completely wireless as you're flying, pull focus remotely. That's great. Having focus control obviously is essential uh, for so many cinematographers and just any filmmakers. Yeah. So having that option, as well as just a, a high quality camera, higher, higher, even higher quality than we had before is a huge thing. Absolutely. So this is really great. Thank you for having us. I really My appreciate pleasure. it. Thanks yeah. for coming. Yeah. Take care. Thanks.